All hail, mighty Railgunia. Welcome back. Is, is that your new intro? Is that your brofist, Mike? That's not, that's not, that's not even close to fucking whatever. You know what? Railgunia! No, fucking all hail Ra Railgunia. I was very specific in what, what I wanted to say. I okay. may not have taken this last button up here. Fuck. Re Regulus. I may not have done that. By the way, when we're done both of our engagements, uh, what we're probably going to do is we're going to probably, um... We're probably going to take out the... Uh, the, the, whatever this guy is, the... Wa Wallab Zealots. The Wubba Lubba Dub Dub. So just yeah. call him that, that's all Wubba you need. Wubba Lubba Dub Dub. Why isn't this guy on fucking aggressive tactics? Okay. I think maybe it is a good idea if I just keep my fleet split up. I mean, our fleets are literally so strong, I don't know if it matters. Situation log updated. I don't think it does either. Situation log updated. All right. We're just gonna keep taking planets. Holy shit! What the fuck is this fucking species here? Member of the Xeno Tolerance Organization faction. <laughs> fuck that. Yeah. Who they... needs filthy Xenos? Yeah, we're we're we're, they're, we're fucking bombarding their planet with tolerance right now. Ooh, the best kind. <laughs> and that, and we're sending down our tolerance squads. This is more like what you have, actually. <laughs> You're the one with the tolerance squads. Okay, you got fucked up. Mike, Mike, tolerance squads eat their face. Just, just for the record. Your tolerance squads eat their face. Yes. They keep sending, yeah, they keep sending, like, little pitiful fucking little... Look at this! He's fucking bombing his, his planet with a fucking 144 so fucking complete. fleet. What it, a dickhead. It could be sadder. Uh, I, I don't think it gets much uh, sadder than that. Also, we have Archimedes. Shit, yeah. Hostile station. Yeah, that's what I'm researching right now, actually. Situation log updated. Hostile station engaged. This guy's trying to run away from the Grand Railgun. No, he's actually engaging it. What What a baller. Situation you know, you gotta fight. give that guy credit. He actually decided... Not a lot of credit, but some credit. He decided to fight us, so what can I say? Oh, we're still going from planet to planet. Alright. Fucking... I can... I, I just got research for, like, Tomb World habitability. That's amazing. Yeah, I, I actually haven't looked at the megastructure in forever that I was making. The Science Nexus? Oh, yeah, I need a shit ton of fucking minerals. I'm just gonna save it for that. I, I, I kind of made it, and then I didn't really think about it after that. Oh, we have max energy credits. Actually, what we can do... Situation log updated. That's weird that I have maximum energy credits, but we just go talk to a, a curator collective. Actually, they can aid us in our research. Holy shit. Fucking 5,000 credits for that? Why? Jesus. Whatever. I, I have fucking energy credits for days. Oh, I also haven't talked to the, uh... What, what are they called? I haven't talked to the, uh, the fucking the Shroud in a while. Oh, dude. Word, word has reached us that the Great Safe Space is undertaking a construction po project of monumental proportions. Uh, oh, started to convert... I wonder what it is. Yeah, you're making rig worlds. I don't know why it needs to tell me that. Yeah, it is a... Well... Yeah, it seems kind of a dick move by the game. It's like, hey, everybody, this guy just spent 20,000 fucking minerals. Go go kick him in the nuts. I guess it makes the game more interesting. Uh, let's see here. What was I going to do? I was going to do... I want to talk to the Shroud. Fuck. Except I'm killing stuff right now, so... I'm sure the Shroud can wait for a minute. Actually, we'll kill this guy. All right, let's kill that. Now let's go talk to the Shroud. All right. Reach into the Shroud, let's have a look. For reasons we cannot fathom, we've been drawn into a corner of the Shroud, this corner of the Shroud, why? We can either get increased influence or increased shield strength. Let's do increased influence. Uh, powerful Psychic Backlash has bounced back. 
through our conduit. Our ships move as if some of some invisible force is holding them back like a rubber band. This has resulted in much slower sublight travel. Fuck you, asshole. Nice. We got we got we got a debuff. So we have mustering. Curse of the Shroud. Sublight speed negative twenty percent. God damn it. Situation log update. How did you even manage to fuck up that bad mic? I, I don't know. I dude, it's a fucking RNG mechanic, Pat. What do you want what do you want me to say? I want you to say that you're sorry. Sorry about what? Swear I'm not lucky? Yeah. I mean, there's really... It's all it, all it is, Pat. Luck-based mechanics. It's all in the heart of the cards. All in the heart of the cards. Alright, I think I got all these planets. That's that's good. Oh, there's another fleet right there. They keep just bringing in, like... It's not even, like, a dangerous fleet. It's just, like... A single ship comes over and starts bombing a planet, and then, like, fucking, like, cleanup crew has to go in and deal with it. Oh, like, they have a shit ton of defense armies here. Looks like these guys are ready. Nope, rip them. They're fucking dead. Unhospitable to tonics. Nice. Enemy planet secure. To what? Wait, tonics? Someone, someone got a trait butcher. Butcher. Yeah, she got armor Eat damage. Wait one second. Mike, I own every single planet under this guy's rule, and I'm only at 41% war score. <laughs> well, maybe you should get good. I don't know. Like, besides somehow learning to slaughter all of his people, I don't know what else to do. Uh, then you, you, who else are you at war with? Just him. Okay. Uh, how does that work then? I don't know. That's why I'm kind of curious on to what you would make, maybe suggest. Um. Fuck, I, dude. I don't. I don't. I don't know about your engagement. Okay. I, well, what's it say about the? I, I, maybe it's just that you did it too fast. It, it, how do you how do you conquer a motherfucker too fast? A, a motherfucker, Pat. They have names. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Whatever. Point B. I think the point of that might be so that you don't just remove him from the game in an instant. Maybe it gives you a, ch a chance for someone else to come and kill him, or someone else to come and save him. One of the two. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Situation. Mm. Oh, I found this guy's spaceports. Nice. Situation. That's where he's like trickling out shit from. What a an annoying piece of shit, honestly. <laughs> Fuck your planet. What the, this is like a tiniest fucking planet, but high quality minerals. I mean, the how, highest quality of minerals. I mean, like. how could I say no? Well, I'm at fucking 68% war score, so, and I almost have this guy's planets, and I have a couple of other people I'm at war with. Updated. So, yeah. I'm just going around and destroying all of his, like, mineral stations and shit, and, and I don't even think that counts. It does count, I think. Maybe. Okay, let's see what, what kind of armies he just put a bunch of defense armies on this planet. Kinetic attack speed. I don't know, maybe I should do nuclear weapons for fun. Let's do nuclear weapons for fun, guys. Nuclear vessels. Yeah, even though we're never going to use them. Fuck them. All right, let's go down here. It's just a, I have like four more plants I can take, and like all the fucking time. How much? How much war score do I still need? I need eighteen because there is a length of war stuff and relative army strength, and will not accept peace offer. Why, why is it? Why is he? Oh, he's an aggressive race, really? Yeah, he's a militarist. That's why he doesn't want peace. <laughs> Not in his best interest this time, was it? Yeah. Uh, where's the other fleet I saw? Oh, they're going. Research complete. 
right, we've got our Archimeter. Focused Archimeter. Fuck yeah. It's even more Archimeter than the last one. Hostile station engaged. Even more Archimeter. Complete. All right, we got climate restoration. Oh, dude, we can make Gaia worlds now. Sweet. Yeah, I'm just researching that one too. Yeah, might as well. So that's that's the climate that's the climate kind of like changes that you can do. I think in this patch you can't uh, you can't actually make it with planet with, with like if you have a planet with people on it you can't actually do it then. But yeah. You are actually correct. I cannot terraform a world I'm on. No. They're, they're gonna change that. It just like there's like a happy happiness penalty or something, and then eventually, uh, then you can just eat them. You can eat them right up. <laughs> exactly. Disgusting noises. I can make worse if you want. Uh, I, I mean that's bad enough. Okay. It's pretty bad, no? Pat. Okay. Sorry. I got the message. Now the question is, was that my tongue or my asshole? <laughs> I don't know, which one do you have up to your face? <laughs> What's the difference between your face and that? <laughs> I was waiting for that joke. I well, set you up for it, Mike. Then you fell for it. I, you fell for my asshole. I should uh, really think about some of this shit before I say it. Nah, thinking is, is difficult. Alright, right, bruh, I own every single one of your planets, I've destroyed everything that you own. I'm just, just saying- Just ride my dick on this out, come on. I'm come just on, saying, bro. you br definitely fucked something up somewhere. Uh, he, d he never wants to engage my fleet, he just sends like little ships out. Alien spaceport engaged. Yeah, this guy doesn't even have the option for that. Situation log updated. It's all good though, because I think I'm gonna have ten years of I can't do anything. Because I see that's what I I want to avoid that more than anything else. Like I want to avoid that downtime. I mean, it's whatever. I'm just gonna research missiles in the meantime. Fucking quantum missiles, yeah. Let's do it. You're gonna America that shit up. Oh, fuck yeah. Be done yet? No, it still has negative five. Oh, that's more world goals, world goals for me. Eventually I'll have to give him a planet called New Light. Oh dude, what the hell are these people? Non-adaptive, Arctic preference, thrifty, oh they're weak, so we're gonna have to purge them. Arctic preference and weak? Yeah, they're, they're, Ow! they're fucking Ow! ballsack, I don't even know. Situation How do you be that puss puss? Uh, he's got like multiple species here, but I think he was a xenophile. So that's why he has multiple uh. species here. All right, I only have one more, one more fucking building to get, and then uh, my unity is completely done. Like, I, 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 I could not possibly do any more unity-related shit. Fuck! Can you guys follow that? Thank you. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! This is the best uh, possible outcome. Oh what god. What did you do? Oh god, my fucking space. Yeah, I, I missed one fucking planet. God damn it. It's actually the same. Well, yeah, he just has one planet left. <laughs> he's one planet in the fucking corner. All right, Pat, you gotta give me. You gotta give me. You it. know, he's got a lot of really good shit there. It's like five energy, ten minerals, six society, two yeah, engineering. Yeah, I'm not dropping any of this this time. I'm actually gonna keep it and I'm gonna enslave his species like proper properly. All right. Properly. Can I modify them? Come on. Can you fuck off? All right. Let's. <laughs> How do I get rid of these robots? They're undesirable. I want to tinker with their insides. All right, there's a fucking ton of shit here. All with right, my hands. Yeah, I know. Okay, the shroud is the telepass is not recovered yet from the strain of a pre previous visit to the shroud. Oh wait, why, why the fuck did I talk to them? Oh, because I must have pressed communicate. Whatever. You know what? I don't. I don't even argue. All right, so we don't want to eat. Uh, where, where are the fucking? Weird ass species that became my fucking main species before this guy. So he's got fucking army damage and minerals, and dude, he's really good at minerals. So we're gonna modif we're gonna set his rights, and he's going to become actual slaves and yeah, not residents. Fuck that. You get sla you get to be slaves. All right. So he's right now chattel slavery. Yeah, that's fine. We can keep him on that. 
Um, so he's he's a proper slave now, and we'll let them repopulate. Uh, or no, we can let them repopulate. That's fine. I I don't mind that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we'll we'll even give them better conditions, even for slaves. Okay, because you know I, I'm not I'm not I'm not a heartless person, Pat. I uh, mean, you kind of are, but yeah. All right, now who else do we have? So we have robots. I don't want robots really. Let's see some of these other tundra worlds I have here. Why are these guys enslaved? Who the fuck are these? I mean, these guys are weak, so I don't really want them. So these guys suck balls. Ocean world. Okay, so there's the these guys. Uh, yeah, these guys have more minerals actually. So you know what? we're gonna we're gonna set these guys to be slaves as well. Oh, well, as I said, we'll, we'll give them we'll give them good conditions, Pad, and we'll let them repopulate. Okay, just because that they're slaves doesn't mean that they have to be unhappy slaves. All right. Who the hell is this guy? Army down. Okay, yeah. So this guy, this guy, we're gonna purge. Uh, these things. What the fuck are these things even? Okay, yeah, we're gonna purge these. We got, we got, we got to pick and choose. It's like a fucking buffet, Pat. <laughs> It's like a buffet of alien brain. We're fucking... We're gonna eat them. Okay, they're undesirables. Uh, let's see. What the hell is this guy? I, don't, I have no idea what those are. Alright. A buffet of alien brains. Okay, so what are these guys? Yeah, I, I just set these guys to get eaten. What planet is this even? Jorgen. Yeah, I don't I don't think we really need that planet. Alright, so now that now that we've done all this, I think I think we're basically done with all this crap. Because these guys are okay. Uh are these guys Oh actually I need to play it for a second and then it just resets everything so that they're actually the proper bullshit now. Alright, so we need to now go to because we have like no energy production, and that would be because we took all these planets. So we need to go to sectors. We need to create a new sector. Oh my god, the influence cost of this is going to be ridiculous. I didn't even think about that. Because I don't actually have a shit ton of influence right now. That's that's the other problem I have. Uh, let's see. Yan can go. We need to make it down to... I mean, it's actually not that bad. I, w I wish sectors took up a uh, yet of research to make sectors take up less minerals, though. Where's this ocean world? Uh, it's right there. Okay, I gotta ask, because it's, it's, it's actually bothering me now. How much influence are you getting per turn? Three. Okay, more than I, more than I thought, less than you probably should. Uh, I mean, the thing is, um, I, I need to be at war all the time to get more influence. It's kind of the way it works. Mike, eat bitches, get money. <laughs> all right. I think. I think. Yeah. Okay. That that does it for all the planets. All right. We got them all. What the fuck is this little bitch doing? He just popped out a colony ship like it don't even matter. He just made a new colony ship. No. Yeah. He popped out a colony ship. I. I, 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 I you're giving me a lot of time to look around and look at stupid shit. So yeah. I'm just like like looking at all the things this guy's doing while I have control over every bit of his territory, and this motherfucker just says, ah, "Now's a good time for this." What the fuck is wrong with these people? He's uh he's he's done with this fucking sector, Patty. He wants to go home. He's done. All right, we're we're resuming. All right, let's go to Rail Gunny actually. Oh, I have 20k minerals now, actually. We put that right into the Science Nexus. I, I, I've been holding on to that for a while, actually, I think. Alright, we have some shit to do. Ships upgraded. Alright, let's see. Ships upgraded. Alright, we got some shit to do. Oh wait, wait! I, I I didn't set the guy's uh, priorities. Actually, where is he? Where are you at? Your sector setting. Okay, you're gonna give me most of your shit. Yeah, that works. Okay, there's a, there's some unrest. 
That's okay. There's some unrest. That, that, that's okay. All right, we're going to set him to do a... Uh, where's mineral focus? There you go, mineral focus. Uh, I'm not going to let him build robots or colonize, though. He doesn't get to do that. So we're going to take most of his resources and basically just tell him to make all that shit. So and that also solved my energy problem, so that's kind of nice. Wait, Wait, it did? Well, I mean, yeah, because he, he was taking some of my minerals. Well, he wasn't giving me all his minerals, basically. Sorry, no, his uh, energy. Sorry, energy. Energy is the word. You're confusing the piss out of me. I'm confusing the piss out of myself, but... Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> As long as we're on the same page. Oh, dude, there is a 17 minerals world here. Fuck yeah. I think you said that. And the I 10. probably did. Oh my god, those are worth keeping. Those are amazing. And I don't think I can declare war on anyone else. No, I gotta wait. Unless you want to kill the zealots. What what zealots? The ones in the top corner of the Fallen Empire. I mean, we totes could. I'm okay with that. I mean, don't bother me one bit if we go fuck them up. Yeah. Did you finish killing him or no? No, I'm still stuck at 46%, like, <laughs> my download's 46% of the way done. It's basically what it's come down to. I think you're getting shrek pet. Technology. Construction complete. Now, here's the thing. I, I, have the, I have the potential to destroy some Frontier outposts now, but I don't know if I want to do that. Like, maybe the, maybe Yugnak can go now. Should I risk it, though? Yeah, I'm going to risk it. Fuck it. Just get rid of it. Because I need influence per turn, like, badly. Well, actually, I really don't. I am making three, and I'm already up to 500, so fuck it. Mm -hmm. Alright, let me see what the ship designer complete. said for the battleships. Do I want Giga Cannon? Isn't there, like, a fucking... I laugh every time I hear Giga Cannon. Yeah, we have Matter Disintegrators. Wow, that's actually a really nice weapon. This put, a, this put together an interesting combination of weaponry, though. It's actually really cool. Alright, fine. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep it like that. Giga Cannon. Pat, you know what? Giga Cannon! It sounds awesome as fuck, Pat. Dude, I probably heard the name, and then I was like, fucking three of those on every ship right now. Just from, just from name alone. And what do we have? Oh, Ships swarm missiles or marauder up. missiles. Okay. Going all the way into that missile tech. So how much, uh, how much is that guy with the sector doing right now? Mike, watch out! Machine Draymond's using his Giga Cannon! Oh, yeah. I need to get this guy a crap ton of minerals, though. Oh, nice. Make preparation for salvaging the System mineral bots. Survey complete. System survey complete. These guys are pretty good. Because the thing is, my territory is also going to change slightly a little bit later. Because I'm eating some of the lesser species that I see there. As 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 actually, that sounds terrible when I say it like that. Eating the lesser species. You know what, Mike? That's a perfectly <laughs> acceptable thing to say in like any situation. In any situation. Do I even care about these? This is like zero point reactors. Fuck it. Like, there's like research in these systems, and I'm pretty sure they're so technologically behind that it's a waste of time to fucking re research any of this. I just want this to be over. What, what? You can have that planet. What do I see the un 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 Biden, unbidden, sorry. But I still see the fucking quest thing. I don't know. It's, ta it's talking to us about the anchors. But, like, we destroyed them before they made anchors. We, we made that... I, I don't have a quest for that. You made that really anticlimactic. Oh, wait. You won. Yeah, I forced them. I forced their hand. Oh, nice. You won the game. Wait, I won the game? Yes, you did. And you're, like, really fucking happy about it. You're, like, jiggling. Yeah, I know. I'm, like, jittering around like a motherfucker. You won by owning 40% of all habitable planets. Oh, okay. I didn't know you were that close to that. I didn't either. I thought I just won the war, and I thought this was just a really fancy, like, war in screen. That's why when you said I actually won the game, I was <laughs> freaked out. No, you actually won. I actually... I, whoa, fuck. I won a game! Fuck, that's all it took right here? I guess it was 40% of the habitable planets. 
That's kind of interesting. I mean, I was making a lot of planets habitable. Does that not increase the victory cost? Or I, I don't know, man. I, I'm actually not sure. I, I didn't expect that. I'm wondering if we should... I mean, you know what? We did actually pretty much just win the game, so... I mean, and we did kill the unbidden. Yeah. I mean, the Joe Bidens, whatever. The Joe Bidens. That That is true. And then there's the... Um, and then there's the Zealots, which... Uh, I mean, we haven't fought them yet, but... I mean, I don't know if they'd be that tough. He's, at, he's currently with war at war. I don't know. You want to try and... Uh, I'm just trying to think of a good way of uh, ending this off. Can that, we continue this? As a well, I mean, we can, but the thing is, like, I'll be honest with you, like, they're all fucking weak to us. They're all pathetic to us right now. So, I mean, it was just going to be us just, like, basically just fucking vacuum cleanup crew, you know, the entire time. Yeah, but I'm not going to lie. I think if it ever came down to it and it was me versus you... It would get really fucking boring really fast because it's going to be like, oh, there's your army over there, and here's my army over here. And then I'm probably just going to be a dick and just be like, you know what? I'm going to just make my army hide from yours and just keep moving on. See, see, it goes here, domination victory, win a game by owning 40% of all habitable planets. I'm not even halfway. You're not? I know. And look at, look at all the territory I have. It's very deceiving. Yeah, but there's a lot of planets in your regions that you haven't taken. Like, if you look at mine, I have colonized every single Holy planet. Shit, I've you did. resurrected planets to build things on. I have a different type of my species for every type of planet, including Tomb World and Gaia. Uh, yeah, that would be. I'm, I'm wondering if that's like adding to the. It, it must not add to the goals. Like, it must like do something weird. Because, like, as I said, I have a lot of un uh, uh, habitable planets in my territory, but I wasn't able to go in there. That's kind of interesting, though. Okay. How many planets do I have? You seem to have a lot, Pat. I have 131. Ah, uh, okay. Well, that's... I don't know how many ha habitable planets there are in total. <laughs> I, I don't know either. Well, I, I didn't I didn't count for this. Okay. Uh, you want know, you know, you know to just end it by, like, my, my fleet versus your fleet, and then that's it? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, let's right, do this. let's continue then. Okay, uh, I, I, I'm just going to make sure I get all this shit in one region of space, so at least it's not destroying... Well, it's not even destroying my energy now. Fuck it, who cares? I can't vassalize you. Fucking 486 war cost. <laughs> it's because my dick is so big, Mike. All right. We have declared war. Where, where's your fleet? Okay, hold on. I gotta get it all together because I have it spread out everywhere. All right. Uh, well, let's 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 meet up in. I don't know. They're also all MIA now for some <laughs> reason. Well, just pick a fucking place for them to go. Uh, uh, you know what? Let's unpause, fast forward the game, so that my military fleet can all at least be together. Okay. Because they're all MIA. System survey complete. Okay. I, I did. That, that was kind of abrupt the ending, but uh, I guess you know. I I, I guess we kind of did kill the un, unbidden and, and all that kind of crap. We were just kind of eating the rest of the galaxy. Uh, I guess we should have formed a federation. Uh, when I mean, you were we so close. Because then I don't think it would have won based upon that. Or maybe it would have, actually. I don't know. No, it would have I would have, It would have actually done that. I mean, it doesn't matter System to me. Survey complete. Whatever, let's see Mike, it matters today. to me. I won the game. Uh, just just pick a system. How about the how about the one where the un un Biden are, un Biden were? I swear to... Fucking god, where, 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 where were the Invidden? Fuck, what am I attacking? God damn it. What are you attacking? You're attacking one of my little Yeah, it's because it was in the way! What What do you want me to do? Alright, let's go to... Uh... Okay, my shit's still MIA, by the way. I'm, go I'm going to Jurgad, okay? You see that little red thing in the middle there? System survey complete. I'll meet you there, okay? I'm by the sun. And by the sun. Br bring your best people over. Construction complete. This, this is who, who truly takes the victory. What do, what, what, what do people think of you now that you're the liberator of the galaxy? Uh, actually, I, I was looking. I was trying to look System at that. Survey complete. Oh, here we go, Mike. It's starting. It's starting. Okay, can you fucking slow it down then? Okay, go, go. I'm here. Make sure you slow the game down, then. I already did. Alright. Oh, do you need Railgun Tech 2, you fuck? Yeah! I out-railgunned you, Mike. Wow, that's cheating. It's not cheating. 
It's called having a bajillion goddamn battleships. Called having... Yeah, you really did make a shit ton of battleships. Holy fucking shit. Station under attack. Yeah, I thought I had more Corvettes. Oh, no, wait. I think you just destroyed all my Corvettes. Yeah, you destroyed all mine, too. No, you still got 30. I have three. Well, I, I think we lost. We lost, boys. You did a lot of damage, Mike. And that's all that matters in Yoshi language. Well, I wasn't expecting the fucking game to just straight up end. I was trying to build up that fucking science uh, building. I actually have like 881 naval capacity now. I, I have 1,724 naval capacity. Jesus Christ. Alright, well, there you go. I mean, that comes with having, like, uh, infinite planets. Goodbye, Admiral uh, Z Zuggleballs. Alright. Zuggleballs? His name is Admiral <laughs> Zuggleballs? Zuggleballs or something. I don't know. That's a good That's a good Admiral name. Alright, guys. We are we are done this. I'm leaving that. So, uh, well, what did we think of the game, Pat? Dude, I fucking love Stellaris. It's such a... It's... It's a good game because it's a fun game. I, I mean, to be honest, this is like I think the first game we've ever actually finished. <laughs> it actually is, and it ended very fast. It, it was it was a bit abrupt, I won't lie, but I, I just don't. I, I actually didn't. I looked at that. I didn't see the point of continuing any further. I guess you guys got the point. I mean, the fun in that was basically that we were just like eating all the plants and all that kind of shit. So, I I, I enjoyed that a lot. Uh, it was it was kind of like a fun little play style. Uh, of how we did that. Uh, it's a very good 4X game. I'll say that It much. really is. Yeah, it's excellent. Uh, I, I will say this. This is not this is not the last run we're going to do of this game. We're like, whatever. Because um, I actually, I really like this game. And I want to do more runs uh, similar to this. So, I mean, this one we didn't do a Federation. Because uh, I would have gotten a penalty cost. So I actually said to Pat, I'm like, I'm not going to do Federation. We're just going to basically go after everyone. That's it. I, maybe the AI would have reacted differently if it realized that we were like together like that. I don't know. It's kind of interesting. I think that maybe we should have put up the AI difficulty by a notch, by the way. Yeah, maybe. But I don't know if that really increases like how aggressive they are or just how much like bonuses they get. Cause I, I really don't know. Because I know in Civ 5, when you increase the difficulty, all it does is gives them like a massive bonus where they could go into like negative credits and shit and yeah. it would not matter. Yeah, I yeah no, I know they they cheat basically, which as I said would have been maybe good enough because we were kind of teaming up against them. But it's one of those things like a hindsight, whatever. I don't know. It it was still fun for me. I I enjoyed it a lot. Um, this the way the place that I was doing. I, I I don't think I enslaved enough species. I think I should. That's why at the very end I decided to start doing that because I'm like, why am I making mineral planets if I can just have like slaves do it? Didn't make any sense to me because I needed minerals mm. really badly. Should just really focused think, on. I think hive mind is OP as balls, by the way. I I don't know about that necessarily because I was getting bonuses on my planets to from happiness. You don't get you don't get that kind of shit. Yeah, but I'm like always kind of like at the max happiness, and once I unlocked any sort <laughs> of like gene modification, I could just make a, I could make a separate set of my species for each kind of planet. Uh huh. And freely just travel the galaxy, eating every single kind of planet in my way. I mean, that's, I think, what they want you to do. That's, that's basically the plan. So, I mean, I, I don't know. It, it was, it was, um, I don't, I don't think Hive Mind is OPOP. -OP. I think they're just like, they got their upsides and downsides. I mean, you don't get the influence from factions or anything, so. But, I mean, I was sitting at the end of that game at like plus five influence a turn. From what? I actually don't know. You must have gotten it from like edicts and shit. How many how many frontier outposts did you have? I had none. Yeah, that's why then. I can guarantee that's why it was. Well, I didn't need any because, as I said, I could get every single planet. I could just go in a line in any direction and then and it'd be like planet, 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 oh, planet, yeah. planet, planet. There's no need for plan uh, frontier outposts. But anyways, I think when there's like major patches for this game, we may revisit it. Um, I mean, there's 1.6 coming soon, which might be nice. Now. There is one thing I, I am thinking about, but I don't know how to do it. So, I was thinking of, like, we could do maybe more of a peaceful game. Uh, but those are kind of interesting in the fact that uh, if if me and Pat were to do that, uh, we'd make, like, a like a, we'd make like a For Reals Federation and, and all that kind of shit. For Reals-y. Yeah, and if we, if we do, like, kind of like a pacifist, maybe science-y sort of uh, run of the game. The thing is, I don't know how you win. Um, I mean, you can win by Federation victory, which is you colonize 60% of planets. 
Uh, but then you have to have everybody in the Federation, and everybody has to be on board with everything, which is a problem, which we didn't really go into. But, um, I mean, that's that's something I wanted to do as well. And maybe at some point we'll do, like, a, a me versus Pat uh, kind of a thing. Like, we'll actually not be on the same side, maybe. I don't know. We'll see how, we'll see how it goes. That'd be... That'd be interesting, actually. I, I also know other people who play this game. Maybe they'll want to come on board uh, for this because this was this was just like I don't know. I, I I was pissed at ukulele for a second for for a little bit, and then I'm like, oh, uh, let's just let's just play Stellaris. Fuck it, let's play Stellaris. Well, Stellaris is a good game. Yeah, yeah. So we we actually completed a run of this. It's ridiculous, actually. It's actually my first time. I gotta lie. Mine as well. I didn't actually know what the victory screen would look like. No cut. I was I was I was very sus, uh, surprised and uh, disappointed actually. There, there was no cutscene or anything. I mean, this is the first time I think they uh, people are saying Paradox actually did a victory screen. Like this is the first time that, like that, like before you you the game was done when you decided it was done essentially. Um, but now but now they actually have like hey you can actually win, so. So, yeah, so uh, I guess um, I guess final thoughts is like uh, yeah. So expect more of the game when there's like major patches. Uh, we'll we'll do it. Like this was one major patch and this was a lot of fun. Uh, and as I said, one point six is right around the corner. I won't I won't guarantee I'll do one for that, but uh, we'll see because I like to switch. Well, up games. I mean the one point six is a quality of life patch that's adding like a lot of like. Like, with the bugs that you were having, and to be honest, with the hive mind, I was kind of running into a few, like, bumpy issues with uh, the civics, but nothing really bad. But, a, 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 like, a good, solid quality of life update for this game, it would not be a bad thing. And that's already saying that this is a good game. It is an excellent game. I, I love it a lot. Uh, so, that's, what, that's, that's all I'm saying. is like, it's going to be a reoccurring thing, probably, so, whenever we feel like it. Uh, I don't know. I, like as I said, I, I'm more more than up for like suggestions uh, if people have them in the comments for what you want to see us do for this. Uh, maybe bring in more people or something else. I don't know because I I honestly think though doing like a full multiplayer game with like tons of play, like human players, I think that would be a horrible idea because you have to you have to play it all in one sitting and it, already as it is, this took like two three sittings with me and Pat because Pat's availability is spotty and shit like that and also we want to pause the game a lot we like doing that but i don't know i'll see i will see so anyways thanks very much uh for watching and i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you guys uh later goodbye goodbye everybody